everybody's running and the world is just so crazy. People work so hard, there's no time to be lazy. The weekend comes, I'm down with that. Grab your ball, grab your bat, head to the beach, grab some rings. Better hurry up, just got some games. Playing games, and you're not going close to them. Go down, go to the mall, lot of fun, it's a ride. They decide the school lunch menu. I hear they can grant you three wishes. Oh, no, wait, that's genies. Tito here. This is major. Any kid in town would give his right arm to be in the Lone Wolf Club. It means power, prestige, uh, discounts at local shops. It's the best thing that can happen to you. Except maybe gaining uncanny superpowers in a freak laboratory accident. Well, you guys, what if they pick one of us? We don't need them. Good friends are more important than mere worldly power. <laughs> Oh, did that sound as cheesy as I think it did? Cheesier. On your knees! <gasps> the Lone Wolves! Silence! We have come for you, Tino Tonatini. Do you wish to join our exalted ranks? Of course. Then you must prove your worthiness. This is your pup name. Read it. Read it loud. <clears throat> My pup name is Cubby Caboose. So ugly, I look like a moose. I'm mangy and smelly, with worms in my belly. For my bad breath, there is no excuse. Oh, my. Learn it, and be prepared to repeat it on command. But wait, where can I find you? We will find you. Be ready to obey any order at any moment. And remember, you must tell no one. Wow. What's up, T? You're all jumpy. Nothing's up. Why? <laughs> what have you heard? I got it! What are my orders? I think this might be for you, ma'am. What are you looking at? Just an ordinary Tino on an ordinary day. <laughs> don't answer! I got it! I got it! I got it! Psst. Why don't you tell everyone your name, pup? And make it loud! Um, Tino? Would you just tell us what's going on? <sighs> my pup name is Cubby Caboose. So ugly I look like a moose. I'm mangy and smelly with worms in my belly. For my bad breath, there is no excuse. <laughs> All right, Tino, spill it. Did somebody make you recite that poem? You might say that. Somebody from this world or the next? Certain questions are better left unanswered. Let's just say what I do, I do for the good of us all. Uh-huh. Uno momento. You are a duck. Let everyone know right now. Oh, no. What's going on? Quack! Quack! Quack, quack, quack! I am a duck! Quack, quack, quack! Look at me, I am a duck! I'm quacking! Quack, quack, quack! It's really very simple. Ghost ducks from the spirit world have taken over Tino's brain. So, Tino, what news from the world of the ghost ducks? Sometimes it can be therapeutic to open up. For pain shared is pain decreased, is it not? I would enjoy a chug of freeze now. You fellows, stay here. Oh, he's about to crack. This chug of freeze is a desperate last ploy to avoid confronting the truth. I prefer chili cheese fries for my desperate last ploys. Pizza works good, too. Tino, we want you to know that... I hate to interrupt, but, uh, Tish, the Dork Society called, and they've elected you president. Uh, Yo, Carve, I'm not saying your hair is out of control, but there's a warrant out for it in six states. Tino? Lord, aren't those the same states that go to a stage three smog alert every time you take off your shoes? <sighs> that doesn't... I'm making a face. Forget it. We're out of here. Hey, 
okay. I know it looks bad, but come on, it's the Lone Wolf Club. The guys would want me to do whatever I have to to get in, I think. Okay, one more time. We're going to apologize to Tino. Yep. Because we walked away. Yep. After he wouldn't stop insulting us. Yep. Had an easier time understanding algebra. Look, we know Tino, and that wasn't him. He's obviously going through some kind of emotional crisis, and we just abandoned him. Oh, hi, guys. Tino just went to the park, but you know, you might be able to catch him. Thanks. Uh, have you noticed anything odd about Tino the last couple of days? Uh, no. Oh, unless you're referring to the fact that he's nuttier than a pecan pie. That's it. I don't know for sure, but I think it might have something to do with a secret club. Secret? <gasps> the Lone Wolf Club! Club! That would explain everything! Well, not everything, but at least the stuff that happened this weekend. <laughs> We're coming to the edge of the ravine. It's a long way down. Lower the Bridge of Truth. Maybe we should skip this part. It's too dangerous. Oh, yeah, maybe we should. Silence! It is the law. He must cross if he is to become a lone wolf. I don't like the looks of this. Step up on the bridge of truth. Stop! <laughs> Where's the ravine? Why aren't they dead? Not that I'm complaining. Kino, thank gosh! What do you guys think you're doing anyway? We thought we were saving you from falling into a ravine. You ruined everything! Us? They were the ones who made you look like an idiot. We're out of here. You have crossed the Bridge of Truth. It was just a board. Okay, the Board of Truth. But you passed an even more important test. You have proven your willingness to put the club above your friends. Wait, are you saying that I might still become a lone wolf? The ceremony of light will decide. <laughs> Remove your blindfold and behold the lone wolf's lair. You will now face the lights of judgment. You mean those fireflies? If the lights remain within the bottle, you are a lone wolf. But if even one escapes, you must leave forever. Let the ceremony of light begin! A lone wolf must keep the secrets of the club. A lone wolf must honor the club and all he does. <gasps> a lone wolf must hold the club above all, including his friends. In accepting the lights, you agree that only the club is important. Your friends outside mean nothing. What say you to this? No! What happened? He let the fireflies go! He can't do that! I can't be a lone wolf. My friends will always be more important to me than... The lone wolf's lair is a laundry room. You can't turn down the lone wolf club! Hans? But you're a geek. Girl? Rat? You guys are the lone wolf club? Uh, do not be fooled by our outwardly geeky appearance. We are the secret masters of Bahia Bay. And we do decide the school lunch menus. Great. Hey, maybe I'll drop by the lair next time I need to wash my shorts. Where are you going? You can't walk out on the lone wolves. Hey, don't tell my mom, okay? She thinks I'm in ballet class. you did was act like you'd gone stark raving mad, heap stupid insults on us, and go ballistic when we tried to save your life. Yeah, it's no big deal. But if apologizing makes you feel better, that's the main thing. Huh, thanks. If it weren't for you guys, I might have never realized what a jerk I was. When it comes to jerkhood realizing, we'll always be there for you. Just one thing, though. Does this mean you're not in touch with ghost ducks from the spirit world? I'm not at liberty to say. Tish, wanna rack them? So, I guess I found out no club's more important than my friends. But here's the really great part. In exchange for not saying anything to Hans's mom, I get to pick the school lunch menu every other Tuesday. <laughs> okay, later days.